This video is powered by the pros at Pascal Air Plumbing and Electric. Arkansas owned, Arkansas operated. GoPascal.com. I mean, every other year, I guess you've been here, it's been mostly returning starters. So a lot of new faces around you just kind of, how are those guys picking things up and especially, especially your tackle? Yeah, it is. Uh, we're the old guys now. We're the two guys in the middle who've been here and done before. And it's kind of, we've taken it as our job to show the new guys, like, this is what you need to do. This is how you need to prepare. Uh, the SEC is a different animal and whatever you expect college football to be, the SEC is like a whole nother level. So, um, and they're doing a great job doing that. We've got a lot of really good young guys with a bunch of talent, not just on the O line, but everywhere. I know y'all are talking about the D line a lot. Um, and it's been really fun to see through fall camp, like guys um, realizing that, working hard, and like really, really showing a bunch of improvement. What at 700 pounds? How much could you go up to, though? Um, it's no telling. I don't know. I don't. Uh, it might have looked easy, but it definitely didn't feel easy to me. So uh, maybe not too much to do. But everyone uh, get under there, all the guys are around you, you know, screaming and. Or the something, so. Yeah, what stands out um, when you think about Bo as a center uh, lining up next to you this season? What's he doing well so far? Well, he's doing a bunch of things really well. Um, Bo's super smart and really calm under pressure, so he does a really good job of giving us a point. The center's kind of like the quarterback of the offensive line, so he always sets us in the right direction. He's done a great job of that. Also, Bo's really strong and powerful, like you said. And, um, like, when we're in combos or when we work together, you can definitely feel it's present. So what's been maybe the most difficult part about the the transition, maybe something even early on in it that you've kind of worked past now? Yeah, most of the part is definitely having to snap the ball before you can fire off. Um, you can't really put any weight on your uh, on your toes or on your, on your hand. you got to worry about it snap the ball and then get able to fire off. So uh, not having the power come off the ball to snap, that's a lot different. So playing with leverage uh, comes into play a lot more, and, uh, especially when you're playing up against the nose like Tank or somebody who weighs more than you and he's an inch to the ball and you know, not being able to fire off that player that hurts a lot. So uh, yeah, playing with leverage is pretty good. You guys are both older guys, but Josh Braun, you know, he's played in the SEC. What have you – seen from him from, you know, a, a standpoint of, you know, playing on the field, but also being a leader as well. So uh, Josh Braun has been an awesome addition. He's great on the field, but he's also a great guy off the field. And I think the biggest thing, the biggest veteran thing you can see with Josh Braun is just the way he takes care of his body and the way he prepares pre-practice, pre-football. Um, he's always in the film room. He's always taking care of his body. And like through that, you can tell that even though he is a little bit younger, he's a, he's a true veteran and, uh, Knows knows how to take care of himself so that he's ready to play. So, Amari Wiggins, what have you seen from him? I guess you know he would be the backup center. You know, yeah, he's been good. Um, like Coach Cameron said, he didn't come in the spring ball. He just got here and he's picked up the offense really well. Uh, from day one, Coach asking questions, he knows what to do. Um, so yeah, that's kind of been usually either can't come in and just land an offense like this, especially with how. Um, you know, complex or offensive now. So if you're able to come in and just pick it up like that, it's really impressive. I can't tell y'all how many times I've been asked, what about the tackles? So what what have you seen from Manuel, Kudas, Chamley, and the backup? Yeah. So I've been playing next to Devin Manuel a lot, and he ha he has a lot of athletic ability. He is really, really athletic. Um, It's been really fun playing next to him. I can always count on him to be there and make the block. He is – uh. He has a lot, like Cook was saying, he has a lot of potential. And I think, like, just moving forward, he'll just be better and better and better. I've had a lot of – I've really enjoyed playing next team. Kudis is doing a great job, too. Um, you know, Kudis has kind of played everywhere since he's been here. He's played center, he's played guard, he's played nice playing tackle. Um, so, him having to learn, you know, pass it and tackle is a whole lot different than pass it and inside. So, um, him trying to get a grasp on, you know, how to set guys, um, kind of the lined up. Uh, that's been a little bit of a change for him. He's picking it up well. And like I said earlier, he's really strong dude. So in the run game, uh, run blocking, run blocking. So uh, he's missing dudes up in the run game, and uh, he's really strong. So it's gonna be good.
play some of the scrimmage and what's happened since then with you and Brian. Man, it's like Coach said too. Uh, we got to we got to pride ourselves on straining and finishing people. Um, we got to be careful in that regard because we don't hurt our own guys, you know, and um, lose all the depth that we have. But at the same time, that doesn't um, that shouldn't be stopping us from you know driving hard, it's just uh, keeping guys off the ground. So uh, we need to pride ourselves in uh, not losing the block and uh, so we the lead. Yeah, I think Bo uh, summed it up pretty good. We gotta, um, we gotta start fast and play hard. I mean, I think the snaps that were in the bowl game, maybe a hundred or so goals over time. In retrospect, how much did that help you? You know, to start in a bowl game and then get all those, all those snaps at that new position. Yeah, it was huge to get at least one game under my belt before I came in the spring and fall um, this year playing center. Um, it's been a big deal of confidence, um, knowing that I can play at that, um, at least at that level, um, and then ca hopefully carry it over to the SEC play. Um, but yeah, just huge confidence boost, um, knowing where to go, um, the spots and um, protections. Um, so yeah, confidence is a boost for me. Like very that. A couple of young guys, um, Luke Brown, I know he's played some practice and guard. I guess, Brady, what, 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 what have you seen from Luke and in the room? What, what do you think about him? Yeah, we've got some pretty awesome freshmen. Uh, Luke's a great guy, and he works really, really hard. He's come back. You know, he got injured in the spring. He's come back, worked really hard to get back, and he's been playing both tackle and guard, and he he gives it all. He's really strong and has a good punch. Um, and then you got Paris, who's at left guard, and he's playing great. Um, Paris is really physical. Um, and when he comes on someone, like, uh, he, he blows them up. So he's doing really good. And then you got Aaron Smith, who has really good hands and good feet. And the, all those guys are really playing really well. Going to go pretty well. We got a lot of young guys playing at a high level. You mentioned Aaron Smith. He's um, came in, to be honest, not a lot of high expectations for him, but he's uh, definitely kind of blown old. Uh, the the world. Yeah. Both you guys. Brady, maybe you can take it first. You all played so much together, you know, started. I mean, just how good a combo do you think you are for, for Cody to kind of build, build a unit, you know, from the inside out? Yeah, it's really cool. It's been awesome to have this experience to play so many games with my best friend. Um, It's been – and it's cool that we're able to build on that. I mean, O-line's a special unit, and you build relations relationships with like that with everyone you play with. Um, Me and Devin are becoming great friends. Um. Kudis is coming in, has a great personality. Um, Josh Braun, we're all becoming friends to eat together. Um, and that relationship that you build, like you, you really build it during fall camp and then it carries over to the season. It's really special. And I'm glad that I'm able to share it with you guys. I remember a couple of years ago, Coach Pittman would say that you'd be the guy that maybe started against guys in practice. Now, um, are there some, maybe some younger guys on the, on the team that got like that nastiness or a little bit of edge to them? I'd say uh, Patrick Kudis really has some nastiness to him. He uh, he plays really, really hard, and he finishes plays. Um, it's it's really fun to watch Kudis, and I can't wait to see what the future holds for him. Aaron Smith got to come in, like you said, walk on, but maybe didn't get the publicity and stuff. But do you feel like he's someone like Street that could eventually play himself into not just scholarship and possibly play him? And meaningful snap and stuff. Yes, sir. I definitely think Aaron Smith could do that. He is uh he's coming, he works hard every single day. He has a really good technique. Um the cool thing to watch with Aaron is like especially like as a young guy, a lot of times you struggle with your hands. His hands are really, really good. He punches hard. Um and he's really uh like stepped up and, and gives us defense in the hard time. Bet Online is your number one source for all your betting needs. Get the latest odds, lines, and matchup reports for baseball, boxing, golf, and more. Bet Online continues to be the fastest and easiest way to place your wagers, including live betting and your favorite casino and card games available to play right from your phone. Head to the website or use your mobile device to sign up today and get in on the action. Remember to use our promo code BELIEVE. That's B L E A V. For for your 50% welcome bonus on your first deposit. Bet online where the game starts.